Now at five, a state lawmaker plans to reintroduce a bill that would appoint an attorney to children in the foster system. Yeah, CBS Force Kristen Eskow spoke with advocates about the program and how it could make a difference. Kristen. Well, Debbie and Bob, those pushing for the bill tell me attorneys can help advocate for foster children and help get them into permanent homes more quickly. It didn't get over the finish line last session due to funding that was needed, but now that it's a budget session, the state senator pushing the bill feels more optimistic about its chances this time around. The system right now is not child centric. Braylon Yerrington has cared for four children through the foster system, none of whom had their own attorney. She says adopting one of those children took five years. It's just very unsettling for a child to be in limbo. So when you have a case that drags on that long, it wears on them horribly. That's why Yerrington is pushing lawmakers to pass a bill that would appoint kids in the foster system an attorney. Republican State Senator John Ford is the bill's author. This can save a lot of money that this can speed up the process for kids in foster care to get to permanency. The bill passed the Senate unanimously last session, but didn't get over the finish line in the House. Ford feels more optimistic this year after lawmakers studied the issue over the summer and are now working on a new state budget. He says his bill would apply to all foster children aged 12 and up. The really debate comes down to when is a child uh, old enough to really know to make is competent to make their own decisions. And so legally, in juvenile cases, it's 12. Those who work with foster children say a lawyer can sometimes help in ways other advocates can't. Nicole Goodson works with Kids Voice of Indiana, which provides advocacy services to foster children in Marion County. At a certain age, children have opinions of their own, right? What the best interest advocate thinks might be different than what the child thinks. The state is still working on estimates for how many children would be served by this program and how much it would cost the state. Lawmakers say they're also working on several other bills related to foster care. Kristen Eskow, CBS 4 News. Thank you. Thousands of